Hey guys, how's it going? It's Dynasty Reloaded, and today I'm back pretty much just to show you guys a quick little bucket plugin tutorial. And in this one, I'm pretty much going to show you guys how to make a lore onto these items. As you can see underneath, it doesn't have a lore, it just says Warrior, and there's no lore except for the plus six attack damage. But I want to show you guys how to put something underneath there. And pretty much, we're going to want to go into Bucket, obviously, or into Eclipse. And we are going to want to make a public static list of strings. And this is going to be warrior lore. And it's going to pretty much return an array list of strings. Or an array of strings. And pretty much that's all you're going to have to. That's probably the hardest part right there, is just to know that. The main reason why that's the hardest part is because most people don't actually know how to put the lore on because it asks for a list. So that's pretty much the part that confuses most people. So really we can go down here and add it on now. There's just be nothing on it. So we can just do warrior meta down here, which is wherever you're creating the item. So warrior meta dot set lore, and then we're gonna set it to warrior lore. Just like that. The array list that we just made up here. Obviously there's nothing in it, so there'd still just return a blank um, lore and there just be nothing there right here we can just do an archer meta dot set lore and we are going to archer lore and that's all we're going to really need to do in this class the reason why I don't actually like adding the strings into the array list right now is because it just doesn't work out too well and let me actually no nah, we can leave that there um, the reason why I don't add it in here is because every time this opens up it's just gonna add more lore so pretty much if I open it up twice there's gonna be like double it's just gonna keep copying down and so to avoid that we're gonna go into the on enable because that's only gonna enable itself once and it's only gonna run through this code one time so we're gonna go to the class that we have it inside the on enable so classes which is where I have it and then we're gonna pull up warrior lore and we're gonna add and it's gonna add a string so we're gonna do chat color dot blue just because I want a blue string there I guess and we're gonna do warriors or um, what else can I put warriors or um, killers and we're gonna add a second line onto that just to have like a little rhyme thing going on I guess or not a rhyme just a little rhetorical question and I don't know why I did that can I please oh there we go all right, so control C, control V. That's what I was trying to do, but I accidentally control V'd. All right, kill, warriors or killers? Who is more, let me actually capitalize it. Who is more dangerous? And pretty much that's just gonna return the warrior lore inside the classes, so we're gonna show this underneath. Now let's add two onto the um, archer archer lore and archer lore let's do archers are the most let's put effective and down here let's finish off the sentence from long range there we go so pretty much now since we have these defined what's going to be inside of each of these um, list it's going to actually add them on whenever it's creating the item so we can go in here and oops let's reload and as you can see right there warriors are killers who's more dangerous archers are the most effective from long range so I know those are pretty tacky I'm probably going to change them before I actually release this or do anything with this plugin but that's just like a little example of how to do it. Somebody asked me how to do it. And if this tutorial helped you guys or if any of my other tutorials helped you guys, please leave a like and share with your friends. It really does help me out. And I'm trying to get up to the 250 subscriber mark and I'm trying to build my way up and keep building up. And that's my next milestone. So hopefully I can hit it within the next month or two. I'm really planning to since I'm recording like every day or every other day now. And yeah, so I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and later.